And the reason behind that, because I know all the way down through all of these post lights, all the way down to that far one over there, the earthing is all a continuous path. So I don't need to do any more at that end because it's all part of the earthing system, which is fantastic. So what we're now going to do is now we're going to be mounting this up inside here. Usually in the box they come with um, a double-sided tape that we can stick on the back of there and we'll just mount that in wherever it suits. So we're going to bring our one mil through here and start terminating that this in. So you can see on the bottom of these as well they have, so we have to the load and supply on the top and bottom. So also we need to make sure that you are sleeving your earth in because obviously you can't leave it like that without any indication of what each core does. So earth in, do not need that right now onto this system because that is going to be connected into the fuse spur because obviously we don't have it on the outgoing side of the switch module. So this is usually where we draw our power on, we get all that sorted. But what we need to do now, because most of these will always come with a 13 amp fuse, and because we don't want 13 amps running down there, we need three amps. Come on out, you come. 